Hello, welcome back to another comic book selling tips. Once again, it's not for the season collectors out there, but hopefully this series is going to be helpful for those that are new to the hobby or new to selling comic books. Not everyone that sells comic books collect comic books, okay? You could be inheriting a collection from a relative so you may know nothing about this hobby that's what this series is for it's for those kind of people that have books that they want to sell or have to sell pressing and cleaning it is one of those things that you may not be familiar with if you're new to this hobby but it is fairly common today it has been something that has become more common over the past decade Trust me, back in 2006, 2007, 2008, and even 2009, there was a lot of debates on whether cleaning and pressing are considered restorations. And by 2010, 2011, that's pretty much put to rest. Um, there are still old-time collectors out there that despise the idea of pressing and cleaning because they think that is doctoring or restoring of books, let them be. You are not going to change their mind. I am not going to change their mind. Let them be. Okay, they can go to the grave believing what they want to believe, but the hobby is what it is. So, if you have valuable books, you should consider pressing and cleaning to improve the grade of the books once again it go back to the very start of this series okay i will put a link to the entire playlist if this is you know something new if you just stumble across this series now you should watch the entire series if you want to benefit from you know getting a better price on selling books but it comes down to grading, okay? When it comes down to pressing and cleaning, it is about understanding enough of grading to know if pressing and cleaning can improve the grade in order to spend the time and money to have those things done. So, it start out with learning how to grade. Number two, if you want to learn how to press and clean, I will put a link below to the playlist that I put together from my own tutorial on how to press and clean if you choose to go that route or you can hire a, prof a professional okay and there are many there are many I'm sure if you google pressing and cleaning comic books you will have a bunch of different ones the price range can be anywhere as low as $10 per book to press and clean to as high as $25 or even more some big books will, will get you know charged a lot more because some professional cleaners charge some kind of they have some kind of formula that charge more than the typical 10 to $25 so if you google it you can find a bunch of professional companies people that offer cleaning and pressing CGC also offer that CBCS also offer that and I'm pretty sure PGX also offer that in-house so you don't have to send the books to somebody and then have them sent to CGC or CBCS you can send the books directly to CGC or CBCS or PGX ultimately it is about you determine whether a book is slap worthy and then know enough about grading to know if pressing and cleaning can improve the look of the book to improve the grade do it yourself or you can hire somebody else but it go back to knowing how to grade thanks for watching bye bye